From giant spiders and snakes to dinosaurs that time forgot, here are 13 crazy African cryptids. Number 13. I am Grootslang. Grootslang doesn't refer to an alien form of plant life. It's Afrikaans or Dutch for big snake or great snake. According to legend, these creatures are as old as the word itself. They were given incredible powers by the gods, but the animals became so powerful that the gods split them into two separate creatures, elephants and snakes. But somehow a couple of the Grootslang escaped and reproduced. They live in a cave filled with diamonds called the Wonder Hole or the Bottomless Pit in South Africa's Richter's Vault area. By some accounts, the creatures can grow 60 feet long, 18 meters, and resemble elephants with a serpent's tail. Number 12. Inkanyamba This legendary lake monster is said to live in a waterfall lake area in the northern forests of South Africa, most commonly at the base of the Howick Falls. It's described by local Zulu tribes as a huge serpent with a horse-like head. The tribes also believe that seasonal storms are actually triggered by the creature's anger. Cryptozoologists have theorized the creatures might be a type of eel, whose reputation has been exaggerated by local myth. Number 11. Serish this cryptid comes from Africa by way of ancient Babylon and is also known as the Masash. It's a hybrid creature possessing hind legs with eagle-like talons, cat-like forelegs, an elongated neck, and a horned head with a crest. It's also said to be part scaly dragon with a snake-like tongue. This creature dates back to the 6th century BC and was depicted in a reconstruction of the Ishtar Gate of Babylon. There's speculation that the Surish was based on a real animal that was possibly imported from Africa. The archaeologists who discovered the Ishtar Gate in 1902 thought the closest match might have been the Iguanodon, a dinosaur that had bird-like hind feet and lived in the early Cretaceous period. Another theory is that it's based on a creature that still exists but remains unknown to zoology. Number 10. Marosi this creature is variously described as a spotted lion or an unusual natural hybrid of lion or leopard. It has no telltale mane and is thought to be larger than a leopard. While sightings of the animal date back to around 1904, the first documented encounter was in 1931 when a Kenya farmer shot and killed two of the animals in an Aberdare Mountains region. Those creatures turned out to be pubescent cubs with prominent spots typical of cubs. The more popular explanation for the animals involved them being lion-leopard hybrids, but that has never been documented in the wild because the two species are natural enemies. What do you think? Number 9. Crowing Crested Cobra This cryptid serpent has been reported in the East and Central Africa and is said to measure around 20 feet long, 6 meters. While their bodies are brown to black, its crest is bright red and projects forward. They're known to be extremely vicious and their venom is said to be powerful enough to result in instant death. As their name implies, the animals make sounds similar to a rooster crowing. They're known to feed off maggots and rotting flesh and will attack humans by dropping from the trees and striking at the face. Some experts think the creature might be a misidentified gaboon viper or rhinoceros viper. Number 8. Enedi Tiger did you know that a saber-toothed cat allegedly inhabits the Yeneti Plateau in the eastern Chad and sub-Saharan Africa? That would seem impossible given that the animal supposedly went extinct around 11,000 years ago. However, there are reportedly two different species of this cryptid. One called Agile is said to mainly roam around the mountains. The other one is a water dweller known as Moru Nagu. Agile is larger than a lion and has a reddish coat with white stripes but has no tail. It's extremely powerful and has reddish brown fur with white stripes, and large teeth that protrude from its mouth. Locals have described it as a saber-toothed cat. Moru Nagu is described as a fierce animal that grows larger than a lion. Going some 12 feet long, 3.7 meters, it has a reddish coloration with white markings. Its teeth are walrus-like, and unlike its terrestrial counterpart, this beast has a long tail. There's speculation that this beast might be an unidentified otter since they can range throughout most of sub-Saharan Africa. We couldn't find a comparison for the cat-like creature. Tell us what you think in the comments below. Number 7. Namibian Flying Snake Snakes are scary enough, but this cryptid from Africa is said to have wings. The scaly creature is described as 25 feet long, 8 meters, and has leathery, bat-like wings that span over 30 feet, 9 meters, making it capable of sustained flight. Reports indicate that it has a neck which can expand and contract, possibly related to its respiratory functions. Among its other odd features, the flying snake is said to have a bioluminescent crest and horns, and is known for emitting a deafening and frightening roar. It was first sighted in 1942 in the Karis region of Namibia, where a man said he sighted a huge snake hurling itself down a hill. Another two sightings of the creature were reported after that. 
Number 6. Na Gwaobu. Allegedly found in the Saharan region of Cameroon, this creature is said to be roughly the size of an ox, but is fierce enough to fight elephants for land. Nagwabu is a regional word for rhino, and this hooved animal is said to have six horns. From descriptions provided by pygmy locals, this creature sounds like it could be a surviving ceratopsian. That was a group of beaked dinosaurs of which Triceratops is likely the best known. There's a problem with that theory though, ceratopsian fossils have never been found in Africa. The pygmies did note that the animals have become more difficult to locate, which suggests their population is declining. What do you think could have happened to them? Number 5. Jibba Fofi Its name translates as giant spider, so no wonder why it's often called the Congolese giant spider. They're said to live in forests and resemble tarantulas with brown coloured bodies. But with a leg span of some 6 feet 183 centimetres, these arachnids have never been identified. Locals say the beast can spin strong circular webs that extend between two trees, with a strand that stretches across game trails. They're said to be extremely venomous and prey on birds and antelope. The earliest sightings of these cryptids occurred in 1890 when they attacked an expedition in Uganda. A better known incident occurred in 1938 when a couple encountered a spider as large as a jungle cat. It blocked a trail they were driving on before scurrying away. At one time the spiders were said to be numerous, now they're rarely sighted and some locals blame deforestation for their dwindling numbers. Number 4. Amelan Tuoka The name of this cryptid translates to elephant killer. There aren't many animals alive today that can live up to that bold nickname. But this beast could be an exception since it's said to have an approximate size of an African bush elephant. Those critters are the largest living terrestrials, weighing some 14,000 pounds, more than 6 metric tons, and standing over 12 feet tall or 4 meters. But a melon tuoka is said to more resemble a rhino with a massive body on stumpy legs and a single great horn on its snout. Like some other big African cryptids, this invites some comparison to dinosaurs, especially ceratopsians, like Triceratops. Some cryptozoologists theorise the creature might be better defined as an aquatic rhino. However it's defined, this is known as a ferocious animal and will kill anything that gets in its way, including elephants. These beasts allegedly live in more remote regions of Cameroon and the Congo. Number 3. The Jungle Walrus In 1910, a big game hunter named John Alfred Jordan and his party claimed to have seen this 15 foot, 4.5 metre long beast in the jungles of West Africa. It's also known as a dingoneck, but its description sounds like a mashup of several well-known animals. While this so-called walrus did indeed have tusks that measured over 3 feet long, less than 1 metre, it was covered in scales like an armadillo. This creature also had a long horn-like structure, reptilian claws, and a broad, thin tail. If that's not enough of an animal amalgamation, natives have described it as having physical characteristics of a sea serpent, a leopard, and even a whale. Maybe it makes sense that such a beast could take down bull hippos. By some accounts, it lives in Lake Victoria and its tributaries. If it sounds too impossible to be true, consider this. At South Africa's Brackfontein Ridge, there's a painting that depicts a creature like the jungle walrus, complete with pinniped-like body and tusks. Number 2. Luquata in the Luganda language, that word roughly translates to sea serpent. These cryptids are described as thick body aquatic reptiles that can measure some 30 feet long, 9 meters. Among its more prominent physical traits, the beast is said to have snake like head atop a 4 foot long neck, 1.2 meters, and two distinct humps on its back. It's said to reside in Uganda's Lake Victoria, where it allegedly created whirlpools and attacked fishing boats. The earliest documented sightings date to the early 20th century when it tried to snatch a man from a steamship, so they seem to have an aggressive nature. This cryptid is often compared to the previously mentioned Dingonek. Both animals have been linked to huge lake creatures that have long been worshipped by native peoples. Number 1. Makel Memba this beast is said to inhabit swamps and pools of the People's Republic of Congo, and it would seem difficult to overlook. It's typically described as measuring more than 30 feet long, 9 meters, and its neck and tail must account for two thirds of that length. Each of those body parts are said to measure 10 feet, 3 meters. While the huge animal has been subject of many explorers, they've only uncovered second hand accounts and mysterious tracks that suggested a three clawed creature. Some people have proposed that the animal is a dinosaur like a brontosaurus. And when pictures of a sauropod dino was shown to natives, they identified it as Macal member. They claim the beast is usually silent and stays submerged unless it's eating or travelling. These seem to be aggressive cryptids, with stories of them taking out hippos and upending boats to kill the passengers. Did you know its name translates to the one who stops the flow of rivers? 
Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit that big red subscribe button and click the bell for notifications for our next exciting episode right here on Epic Wildlife.